That's the day the music died. Yeah, exactly. So the um, uh, it, it's we were close. So in in my eyes, you can see by the interview how it impacted him. And, um, and then, uh, as far as what happened to me, it was like you could you just look back at that year, look at my stats, and you'll know how what kind of impact that was on me. Because it, basically, in my mind, I lost my brother. Once you're over it, uh, yeah, it was. Well, actually, I'll kind of go back and what was kind of special. We had we had 89, 88. He gets traded. We won the Stanley Cup. I thought we had the best team ever. Um, defensively, we were right on, and that was I thought our easiest Stanley Cup that we won that year. 89, we went lost to LA. I'm in LA. Get the phone call going. You're going to the World Championships in Stockholm, and you're opening up in the Globe in two days. And uh, to make a long story short, we ended up playing uh, Russia in the final against oh, Igor's team, and um, they had a guy. On, his, on their team, <clears throat> and uh, it was late after the World Championships we were over, and we were back in my room, and uh, we're drinking some vodka, and this little kid comes in there, and he goes, hey, I'm, I defect tomorrow. Oh, what do you mean you defect? He goes, yes, I defect to America tomorrow to play hockey. <laughs> goes, What's your name? He goes, Alex McGilney. <laughs> so, <laughs> He's in my room, like, you know, after the World Championships, celebrating. So it was like, that, that's one of my... So that, anyway, to get back to the, the point, 90 of us, winning without friends. I mean, uh, I think that year, when we played in the World Championships, we ended up getting a silver medal. Um, Igor's team gets the gold medal in the World Championships, and it kind of brought things back and into perspective. And so that 89, we, everything started to come together again. We had a slow start that season, but... Um, we were playing against Winnipeg and it was like we were down 3-1 in the series and we came back and we ended up winning that series and that kind of um, escalated our, our confidence and we, um, we went on to uh, defeat uh, Boston and it, it was like, uh, um, it, it was right on that point where we had enough confidence and enough uh, firepower with, um, with Elkrets that we still had a phenomenal team and you know Mark Curry and, and you know you got Kevin Lowe. We had great goaltending. Billy Bramford played unbelievable. Ended up winning the Conn Smythe that year. So I mean, if you get good goaltending, you got a chance to win every night. Say uh, uh, 98 because of that uh, the loss to Konstantinov in the car accident. And uh, like Glenn said, it took us a while to uh, regroup. But uh, to, uh, to be at the team, like uh, very strong during the year and uh, winning back to back, that was uh, amazing.